up everybody. So in this video I'm going to show you how to set your syntax highlighting for the PaperScript JavaScript library inside of Sublime Text 3. So I wrote some instructions for a student that just asked about it. I'm going to share those with you all uh, in the description for this video but I want to go ahead and show you kind of a video walkthrough of how I do it. So first and foremost download and install Sublime Text 3.1.1 build 3176. So I have the link there for installation of that and well for download and installation. Once you get that installed, that's the latest version of Sublime right now, then you're going to want to install package control. I have a link for it. There's really explicit instructions in there. So use those and then restart Sublime when you're done. And then you're going to install package resource viewer for Sublime. Really easy to install. Uh, once you're done with that, go ahead and restart. So now open the command palette and you're going you can do that from tools command palette with sublime text task menu so let me go ahead and open this up here and of course the issue that we're trying to fix here is we have an HTML document we have an internal script we have set it to text paper script and we're not getting any highlighting here and so we want the highlighting to appear just like this so in order to do that we need to follow the rest of these steps so this is my sublime window here's the instructions and basically we want to open the command palette so for me that's command shift P and then I can type in open resource and you'll see the first one here is package resource viewer open resource so I can go ahead and select that and now it gives me another little drop down here and so I'm going to search for HTML so there's HTML it's the only option I'm going to hit enter and now I've got a couple options you can type in sub and it'll break it down to where there's just HTML sublime syntax and that's the one you want so if you hit enter it will open up the HTML Sublime syntax file inside of Sublime and you can edit it here. So this is just a YAML file and we're looking for a specific part of this file that we can change. So if you go to the tutorial that I have written out here, you'll see that I say search for this code right here. So you can copy it. But basically, you're just looking for the word ECMA, E-C-M-A. And if you find ECMA, then you're going to find the code that I have inside of the tutorial. But basically it's just this question mark, colon, Java, and then the pipe, and then ECMA. And so we'll add another pipe, and then the word paper, right here. And this should be on line 38 for you. It's inside of this JavaScript mind type block right here. In any event, you'll change it to where now it has paper in addition to Java and ECMA before the script. And if you save this file, and you go back over to your example, voila. Now the syntax highlighting is working for text paper script or the paper script JavaScript library. So that's it. It's really simple. Uh, I will have these instructions, like I said, in the description of this video. So feel free to walk through them. And if you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. Thanks a lot, and we'll see you in the next video.